hey guys welcome back to my youtube channel do you know how to test your internet speed using python if no in this video i am going to tell you that so whenever you feel like testing your internet speed you can simply execute the code that we are going to write now for this firstly i am going to import one external module so go to your terminal here type pip install speed test dash cli and hit enter once the module is successfully installed now we can import it so i'll write from speed test import speed test class now we just have to create object of this class and we will be able to get download and upload speed of our internet so how do we create object we just write the class name and assign it to a variable so here i am going to assign it to speed variable so this is my object now with the help of this object variable we can access the methods which are present inside this class let me download one more external module which will speak download and upload speed so go to your terminal again and here type pip install pyttsx3 it's already installed for me once you install it now you can import it so write import pyttsx3 so inside this module we have a method that will help us to convert text to audio so let me store download and upload speed in some variable so here i'll write download equals to dot download method this method will return the download speed of our internet and that speed will be stored inside this variable in the same way i will store upload speed in this upload variable so i'm going to use this object variable dot upload method this method will return upload speed of our internet and that will be stored in this variable now let's use the speak method of this pyttsx3 module here we will be passing the text that we want to convert into audio your download speed is with this string i am going to use this variable so i have to make this as a f string and here inside curly braces i will be able to use this variable download in the same way it will speak upload speed so i'm simply going to copy the same line and here instead of your download it will be your upload speed is and instead of download variable i'll be using this upload variable let's run this your download speed is 10447343463682829 your upload speed is 11184698124679977 so this speed was in bits per second if you want to convert it into megabytes per second then you will have to divide the speed by 10 to the power 6 so here let me get the speed in mb per second so i'll create a variable download underscore mbs equals to i will use this variable download in which we have a speed in bits per second and i will divide this by 10 to the power 6 let me keep it in parenthesis like this in the same way i will convert upload speed in mb per second so i'll write upload underscore mbs equals to upload variable and i will divide this by 10 to the power 6 let's print these two speeds so i'll use this print function here also i'm going to use f string Firstly I will be printing the speed which is inside this download mbs variable and then I'll add a string mb per second then upload speed inside this curly braces and the string next to it here also let me add mb per second mb per second and this variable will change to download underscore mbs and here it will be upload underscore mbs let's see now your download speed is 44.039300957214245 mb per second 
your upload speed is 60.564369866421641 MB per second. Here you see this is my download speed and this is my upload speed. Let me add these strings here. Download speed. And here before upload speed, I'll add upload speed. And I would also like to round off these values to two decimal places. So I'm going to use round function here. Inside this function, I'll pass this value and number of decimal places. I want only two digits after decimal point. And similarly, I will round off this upload speed like this. Let's see once more. Your download speed is 5.29 MB per second. Your upload speed is 50.31 MB per second. I hope you understood this. That's it in this video. Thank you for watching.